Hey everyone, this will be the unboxing of the uh, Biostar T-Series TA890GXB HD. Comes in a nice little black box. Uh, you probably saw this in the other video, all the little features on the front. So you might as well open it up and see what it looks like. Alright, so it comes with two or three uh, SATA cables and a Molex to SATA power adapter. The back panel, kind of need that. Drivers and utilities disc, probably not going to use that. The uh, motherboard manual, I say main board, I say motherboard. Potatoes, potatoes, whatever. Alright, and this is what you want to see. Motherboard. Nice little casing. Kind of have to do this with one hand, so I might be editing it out while I try to get it out of its uh, little plastic bagging, a little anti-static. There we go. Alright, there you go. Looks beautiful. Has uh, four, sl four slots for DDR3 RAM. Dual channel, of course. Uh, AM3 CPU socket. I do not know if it's AM2 Plus or not. I will put that in the description. Uh, one PCI Express 2.0 and two just PCI. Um, six SATA ports. Uh, reset switch and uh, power switch just in case you uh, want to test it before you put it in your case to make sure everything works. This little heat sink for the north bridge and one for the south bridge. Well, that's hardly a heat sink, it's so tiny. Um, Alright, so... A little protective bit, kind of want that. So, for the back ports, we have PS2 for keyboard and possibly mouse, TUSB, HDMI, uh, DVI, VGA, two more USB, Gigabit Ethernet, and audio ports. Nothing too fancy here. I will be getting a newer video card at some point, but this comes with a uh, onboard. Oh geez, I don't know what series. It's a uh, ATI 4000 something. I don't know what it is exactly. But I will be posting a uh, a review of this motherboard. At some point, I don't have the case yet, so I'm not going to bother building the computer, so yeah, more unboxings to come.